get going. Um, do I consider myself an experienced football manager player? Um, well, kind of? Yeah, sure, why not? Um, found around the south. The good old Maidstone United. But yeah, uh, Maidstone. Um. We'll, we'll do your world, why not? And now we've got two ads countries, which again will be the typical big five for this sort of save. There's no point going any more than that. If I was doing a journeyman save, I would do probably ten countries, but um, yeah, we're just going to do the England, France, Italy, Germany, Spain, and be done with it. There we go. Let's get going. <clears throat> I'm excited for this save. It will be. It will be interesting. Who knows what's going to happen? It's loading. Here we go. Let's get cheese. God, sexy one. English, I'm male. Uh, I'll just I'll just be as young as possible, why not? Make me feel a bit better. Um I'll put my actual day of birth in though. Uh confirm right. I am as pale as can be. I am to be honest, that's about right. Um I'm very skinny. My head Right, facial hair. I don't really, I don't have facial hair. What's with the freckles? But okay, hang on. Does that mean facial structure? Because these all look the same to me. Anyway, skin details. There we go. Eye colour is blue. Eyebrows. Yep, they'll do. Hairstyle. Uh, um, that shade. Um, I've recently had a haircut, so I am um, sort of this at the minute. But a bit. That's medium. I need short. Yep. Um, attire, oh I can make my, I'm gonna make my clothes f yellow, there we go, yellow, yellow, 
the tie yellow 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 ability aids oh i don't have a hearing aid uh eye patch i can wear an eye patch Yes, I'm gonna wear an eye patch. Um, glasses, I don't wear glasses, I used to. Apparently you can wear an eye patch. How are you Ivan, I hope you're well. Uh, war child. Face, I can have face paint as well. Now, do I do it just full yellow, or do I match the clean colours for my face paint? I reckon we just go full yellow, you know. Ring. Hello, Ben. How are you? Right, I can't change the colour of the ring. Are you, ser are you serious? Ooh. That, that doesn't sound great. I can change it, but it's automatically, yeah. But yeah, that doesn't sound great, Ivan. I hope that does sort itself soon. Are you taking any, like, meditation for it? Or, if you can, or, um, maybe send a, send a doctor, or something. Uh, glad to see you're doing well, Ben. Um, we are just, right, both. Yellow. I don't wear earrings, but, you know, we're making this guy as yellow as possible. Why are we going to wear watches on both wrists? I mean, obviously I'm going to. But why would you? Um... I think we're ready. To get started. Great! Summer McDermott already. Uh, not very happy with us. Um, yeah, we relegated from the Van Rama National last season, we know. Second qualifying round for the FA Cup, second round of the FA Trophy. Below average training facilities, basic youth facilities, basic youth recruitment. So this is Football Manager 2024. So this fully released uh, Monday, so two days ago, if it's Wednesday today. It is Wednesday today, yes. Lovely. Two-time Vanarama National League, one Vanarama National League South, which was uh, two seasons ago now. Playing such flip and sensitive stuff, but mine's okay nowadays. Uh, Minesweeper, I'm assuming that is. I've never even one that's been into League of Legends, I'm going to be honest. Oh, already got an achievement. Uh, principles, your principles are the foundation of your methods and what defines you as a manager. How your players react to your decisions in various situations will depend on these. Right. Interesting. So, I'm just going to do this based on what I would do and what I feel like I'd try to be, which is, um, resilient. I feel like that's quite a good one. Hang on, I need to close you. Resilient, um, Dedication and teamwork would be the three that I would go for personally. Obviously, people that play this would probably do different stuff, but this is a new addition to the console version for this year. Um, you're on your PC about eight hours or more a day. Wow, that is quite something. George Alakobi. Can I hire George Alakobi? No, I can't put him back at, as a, a system. Uh, that's a shame. Reach the Vanarama South playoffs, competitive in FA Cup and FA Trophy. But then, ooh, so. Yeah, we'll just upset that. Oh, so many people here. Gavin Hoyt still here, 33 now. Ray Brown. Perry Andolo, um, lovely. Yours is fine now. Oh, so it, it it can improve then. So that's that's encouraging at least. 
Right, we are gonna send the friendlies, probably. Because no, I'm not really interested in playing. Right, here we go. Set pieces. Um I out of the two, I'm not a massive zonal marking fan. I do prefer man on man marking. Oh, there we go. I like how uh, <laughs> Ben's just mentioned it just after I've mentioned I said about it. That was quite funny. Um, have these balanced. Yes, it's not very specific, but I'm a very balanced man. Uh, central. I'm going to say near post is probably fine. In swinger. I don't know, out the two, I always prefer outswingers, but we'll go in, in swingers, just for the staff preference. Right, let's get going. Play for the win. I will need to, I should have clicked, um, don't show this again, so that will come up every game now. 5 nil win. Lovely stuff. Favisham. I mean, these are all like pretty basic friendlies. First game on the 5th of August against Slough. Rochdale will be a tricky one, as will Dagenham and Redbridge, who are somehow still in the Vanuatu National League and they're just always there. Um, is that someone moving a suitcase? Outside my house, I don't know. Set pieces induction. Set piece overview panel. Yes, okay. Near posting this one. Um, what's my must respond? I said, Peace, tactics is fine being with me. If we go to tactics, we're not. Hmm, I'm not so sure. I do like a 4 3 3, but I'm not sure about the cautious mentality. I like a good wing play. We'll have to figure out tactics as things go on. As things go on. Um, We go fairly wide, just narrow it up a little bit in transition when possession's been won. Um, distribution type, I'd rather take. Rolling out's fine. Um, Out of possession. Stop crosses. Provincial dollar distribution. Um, that's fine. Overlaps, I don't mind overlaps. Um, be more disciplined. We can work all into the box as well. We'll save that. Done some custom stuff with the tactics. Um, finances. We've got a bit of wage budget to spare. We've got about two and a half K to spare. Um do we have a look at players? See if there's anyone not actually I do need to have a look. Hang on. We're bringing back someone that people know very well. If he's even in the game. He's not in the game, no. Darnell Winters. Um that is sad. Now the time between Bolton and Birmingham. Um, 
Sulfid Reserves here. 275k. Can we have him on a loan, please? Um. Who's interested? I mean. Acceleration on 12, pace 12, natural fitness 10, Elliot, 18, determination, hello. Kai Kennedy, high natural fitness, Hope Akpan, would be third choice midfielder if we had him before, why do we know him? 1.2k a week. Okay, maybe not then. Shwack. We'll just scout a few people, see what's going on. Um, between those two though, for, uh, Bolton Burning. I mean, Bolton's always an interesting one, obviously. Ex Premier League, what they're now, League One, I believe. They are, so. That's always a good story to try and get them back into the Premier League. Yeah, League One. And Birmingham are championship. Both ex Prem teams, well, yeah, true. But obviously, I think Bolton have obviously been in League Two at some point. It's not great. We won't offer them a contract. Hmm, hello. Hang on a minute. Third choice at the minute, but potentially... Skybet League 2 standard. If we just remove and exclude those. What are my initial thoughts on taking the motion drop? Overwhelming excitement. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's interesting to see how many like ex Prem teams have fallen down now. Kai Kennedy, hang up, three point six. Don't do this to me, man. I oh, want two point three k a week. I can offer you eight hundred quid. Um, please join. Oh, please, please. <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's annoying. Hello, Schwack. Why are you apparently like? Legendary. Get in my team. Oh, you're killing me. This is killing me. Why are all these players so good? We do need to go back and start a few more, it seems. Okay, no. That's not going to work. You're not going to work. We'll go back to the player search. Now, yes, they're all amazing. Joe Idaho. Daniel Powell, he's 32, he's quite old. Daniel Rose, 19 year old Irishman. John Nolan, old but could do a job for us for now. Holy mackerel, lots of people want him. And that's why I can't afford him. <laughs> um, 34 clubs interested. So you know they're good when, like, just everyone's interested in them. So we've got to try and pick out the ones that we could get. He's 41. Maybe maybe we won't sign him. Um, we've got another friendly. I mean, look, if we're only playing one striker, a striker isn't our priority, but we do need to improve our keeper. Is probably somewhere we need to improve. 3 0 win there. I say that he has kept two clean sheets thus far. If we play a search, new search, um, add condition, transfer, uh, is that what I need? Is it contract? General. Um, that's not it. Oh wait, hang on.
Oh, wait, hang on. Remove you. It's just in there. Between those two, personally, I would say Bolton. Um. Hello, Ding. How are you? Um, expired. I haven't done Goalkeeper. There we go. Glad to hear you're doing well. We are looking for keepers. If we go all the way up to the top. Brian Schwack is just amazing. Uh, we'll just scout like the first 10 or so. Tom Smith, that is a British name if ever I've seen one. Yeah, that's a proper English name. Liam Hughes as well. Okay, it's Northern Irish, but you know what I mean. We'll scout a few of those, but yeah, new keeper, because if we have a look here, that's the wrong one. If we have a look here, our team looks strong. Centre back as well could be an improvement area, but goalie is the weak area right now. Are you saying we only have four substitutes? We might need some more substitutes. Uh, squad, uh, move the senior squad. Bosh. Uh, move to senior squad. Yeah. Oh, that's nice, Ben. So, yeah, when we figure that out, that'll be good. Um, I don't know if we have even 20k. A network save, is it multiplayer? Uh, it can be, yes. Do we even have 20k? Oh, we have 300k. 20k is nothing. John or Joel, look at this. He would be great, but the wage. So not him. But yeah, so you can do it multiplayer. Marcus Stackers is on loan. Okay. Lovely. I really like that. Little about on PC, Dean. Fair enough. I can't say I blame you. Obviously, the PC version is a bit more like how you're pretty rubbish. You're pretty good, but would you want to come to me? If I remove that, I remove that, I remove that, will you come to me? No. Maybe not. Marcus Black is now here, we need to change his role for something he's actually good at, like target forward. Woking at home will be an interesting one. That's actually a proper sort of level one on our team. We win 2-1. So that's good. Yes, Marcus Dackers. We've signed him in on Lonely because he's worth 275 grand. And if we look at the finances, I only really have 412. So, yeah. We are looking at Hello. But I can't. I need a goalkeeper. Yes, I'm very pleased for Marcus Dackers to be on loan here. Hopefully, he'll stay on loan here for the rest of the season. Rian Jamal, midfielder, won't sign for us. Midfielder won't sign for us. That's fine. Cancel transfer, I'm fine. Rochdale will be the toughest one. Stand game progress within tribal. It is a very information heavy game. People please, I have a happy squad. Well, that's good. Sam Packham. These are all pretty good. Practical signing, but not really great. Hello. I know he's 34, but the wages. I hate work permits, man. Tom Smith, too much. Liam Hughes might not be too much. Hello, you want to join us? I can work with that. Hang on. Remove you. Remove you. Remove. Actually, you have your clean sheet bonus. If I increase your sign on fee. Ah, come on. 
damn close. We have something to work with there. Oliver Davies, no. Well, that's a good point. Where's our media prediction this season? Our media prediction is third, which would be playoffs. Start in mind in the week. Well, that's great to hear. Uh, again, we've got the issue of uh, work permits. Because I'll gladly offer you 800. But again, don't see it happening. Recruitment focus, season ticket sales, 1,000 season ticket sales. We've got Sam Bone there. That's lovely. Um, Great. Again, work permits being annoying, but uh, normal. That's fine. Uh, Watch will be an interesting one. I just hope we can sort of play well, really. It's at home, it's at the Gallery of Stadium, so, I don't know, a 3-1 defeat against... Wait, aren't what's going National League now? They are, ooh. ooh. But we played actually quite well. We just couldn't really finish our chances. Um, play through injury. You can you can do that. I believe in you. I don't know what it was. Okay, cancel the transfer. So we need English really on the goalkeepers, but they're always rubbish. That's the only issue. Earl is doing a suitable enough job. 1-1 one, one draw with Dagenham and Redbridge, which isn't too bad, sitting Dagenham and Redbridge are also National League. Um, if we go back to recruitment, edit the search. Um, add condition. There we go. Then we'll just scout a bunch of these, because we don't have the, um, issue with our work permits, so we'll scout a few of those, see if we can maybe get one of those in. Hello. You're pretty good. And I can get you in for cheap, so we can uh, just go for you. Remove you, remove you. Can I have a clean sheet bonus? 700 grand, 700 grand a week? No, I'm not paying you 700 grand a week. Gavin Hoyt, Sam Torn, that's fine. That's fine, we've got a decent goal in, hopefully now anyway. Not bad, got good potential. Same with Ryan Hammond here. Essentially Skybet League 1 standard. We might get two goalkeepers in, why not? He was quite cheap as well. And Ryan Hammond. Ah, oh, lovely. Birmingham Bristol. Oh, I've had so many good teams won him, that's not great. But we are quickly approaching the first game of the season at home against Slough. And just like that, we're there. Managerial debut. We are favourites. And we are expected to reach the playoffs. Dakers, Coleman, the draft, Reynolds. That's a good, it's a solid team. Hoyt. So we only allowed five subs anyway, okay. Fair enough. Let's get into it.
straight into it. First game at home against Lau. Finally, we've had a shot. We now have a corner. Nippos doesn't really work out for us. To think I've been a linesman on this in this stadium, it's quite strange. Obviously not for the actual Maidstone team. Oh, go on, with the header. Oh, oh come on. Wait. Can do better there, my friend. The first highlight goes to us. Crucially. We just need to build on it. Penalty. Choose an alternative. You know what we're doing here. I love how it immediately jumps to the keeper as well. Holy hell. Come on. Oh, crying out loud. I really wanted the first goal of this save in a proper match to be scored by our keeper. That would sum me up perfectly, but alas, the penalty is missed. And back as heads over from the corner. It's fine, we're being the better team at the minute. Yes, now have more possession, but we're on top. Yes, I know how team talks work, my friend. I also know how this thing works. This was in last FM, my friend. Don't you worry. No, still nothing. Oh, is right back. We can't run, he can. Rick Brown's also a wing back. But we'll, we'll leave it for now. That's just the one substitute. We have the free kick as well. Good, patient play. Oh, beautiful finish from Connor Kelly, and we do have the lead now. One out. Lovely stuff. Just really good, patient play. Found the space. Made the run. Defended that off. Curling it into the far right corner. And we do finally have a go. Reynolds with the assist, looking for a second, not quite going to happen there. It's coming to grass now, going to the box, and that's 2 0. That has gone off the defender, and it counts as an own goal. But our lead is doubled, and that could be it. Only 20 minutes to go. Aran Sibla. And Levy Manchi can come on. I've made two attacking substitutions when we're 2 0 up, yes. But look, I would say it's worth it. This could have been 3 0 if Harley Earl would have scored that penalty. Garun, 3 0. 10 minutes in. Uh, 10 minutes in? 10 minutes to go. 3 0. That's the point to draw, and we are enjoying ourselves here. On opening day. Finally, you still have a shot. It's only taken 85 minutes, and now they've had two. But full time, 3 0 win. Got to be happy with that.
with that one. Good win, something we can move on with. Second in the league now. Get a clean sheet. Some of those teams like Western Supermare. Interesting. Bath City away from home next. Um, Kelly Straws on debut. Reynolds, I ain't got an assist there. Could have had two, potentially. Um, but yeah. Good result to start off with. Sam Bone and his support was gained by in. That's really good. And there we go, we've got the keeper. A better keeper even, sorry. He was also potentially Skybet League 1 standard. So, that's pretty decent. Um, are you confident? Yes, I'm very confident. Yes, he's only young. He is only 18. Do we need this guy now? Always good to have a backup. Although I feel like I haven't put them up both on first choice, but there we go. But we will rotate keepers if we feel we need to. I'm not afraid to do that. Riley Court did well. That's good. Changes. Only for two, three days though. That's that's not that bad. Brain tree. First in the league at the moment. Our third game of the season. That will be an interesting one. But Bath City, we are apparently underdogs here. Obviously, the being away from home does play a factor. But there we go. Kovacevic. Makes his debut in goal. Other than that, is it an unchanged lineup? I believe so. Nathan Jetch is the guy promoted. Um, midfielders we might need to look at then. Our midfield influence doesn't look great, but Marcus Becker is starting again up front. Can he get his first goal for the club? Just so yellow. Well, this game's very slightly different compared to um, the Slough game. The Slough game we were comfortable in control. At this point, 20 minutes in, we've only had 30% of the ball. And that's shrinking. Oh, that's, that's a poor ball to give away. But he's won it back, he's won it back well, but he hasn't. That is one back. And we can play from this. Reynolds is going to go it alone here. Oh, buries it in that far corner. What a run and what a finish. And despite looking a bit like Cluster in stats, we have the goal and the lead. And, well, ultimately, the one stat that does matter in football is the amount of goals you have. Our time at 1 0 up. We can keep this up, potentially. We can potentially double our lead here. Just need to be patient. Pass there, Dakers to Kelly, scored the eyes, scored the oh, the graph, that was, that was quite a bit over the bar, but we almost played in Kelly there, who obviously scored the opener. So 
but just controlling the ball at the minute. Kovacevic on his debut. Point to Reynolds. Reynolds going for a run again here. Gets tackled this time, but he recovers. And can... There we go. Goes for a run again. Reynolds crosses it in. Marcus Stafford's just over the top. Nearly. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Not quite to be. And we're doing all this with not even a third of the ball. Another highlight. Good play. Reynolds into Marcus Lackers. Last set over the bar. In terms of subs, Rafe Brown can come on. Fowler can come on. I don't have anyone to put in midfield. But around the Stibia can come on. Oh, here come Bath City now. Are they going to punish us for our... <sighs> Close in Bath City there. Almost punishing us for our lack of clinicality there. Seven minutes to go. Can they find a late equaliser or will we be able to hold on? I hope they don't score a late eagle. That's going to Brown. Back to Kovacic. Kovacic, Kovacevic. Ah. Oh no, I don't like the look of this. Oh, Reynolds, yes. I like the look of this though. Oh, I do like the look of this. Sam Korn to around Sibia. To Dakers, to 2 0. There we go. That is three points secured, surely. Is that Irish dancing that he's just doing over the celebration? I wasn't really watching. Sweat two pass, a cross goal. Goal is never going to get that. Beautiful stuff. And, well, despite possession wise being played out of the park, it is us who come. Oh, wait, hang on. Let's not speak too soon. Breaking the data. Yes. Indeed. Right, did their shot just get blocked by their own defender putting uh, Reynolds in on goal? He had to go from like 25 yards out and just puts it right in the post. But that is full time. That's a 2 0 win. And that's a very good result. I'm hoping Dappers were going right. Ugh, Tunbridge, our rivals. Um, Torquay Top, where are Braintree? They are now ninth. Another away day though, and it will have to be some form of rotation, I reckon. Not that we have much rotation options. Hilly plays for Madras. Yes, I know. I, I was born in, well, I lived the first six ish years of my life in Tunbridge. And then moved to, um,. Maidstone. That's a long story. That's a story for another day, that is. Um, so why are we even behind Torquay on? That's what I want to know. Oh, because they've scored nine goals but conceded four. We haven't conceded a goal yet this season. Obviously, it's only been two games. So. But there we go. Brain tree. Tempted, I've got a start. Bones now playing at CDM. Kelly's been dropped. Fowler's now on at centre back. So the only person we're really resting here is Kelly. Um, I'm tempted to start around Sibia. 
Hammond, I'm also happy to start, maybe. But no, we'll leave Politevic in. He kept a clean sheet. He's got no reason to be dropped. Um, Nathas is a bit tired. Who could we swap him for? No one, really. Let's be honest. Okay, Nathas, you can start. Bring Tree away from home. Corner. Early days for Brain Tree here. This does not bode well. Crossed in. Not really cleared away, let's be honest. There's no way. Strike? No, they don't strike. They pass it across and Reggie Lamb. Second goal of the season and Brain Tree take a very early lead here with the four fans that they've got in the stadium. Interesting to see what we can do as a response. That is not a response, that is capitulation. There we go. Around Sibia. Just be patient. Just be patient. Good. Rossi Watson. Huh? Marcus Stackers. 1-1. One, one. There we go. Sorry. What did I say? I don't know what I said now. What do you want them? Capitulation. There we go. I think that what you was confused about. Yeah, capitulation. So three minutes in, and it's 1-1. One, one. Um, pretty kick now. Oh, God. We've had three goals in the first ten minutes here. And once again, Braintree are, uh, well, leading. bit of a crazy start to this game, I'm going to be honest, every shot on target thus far has gone in. Are you kidding me? You can deal with that for the rest of the game, let's be honest. It's a bit of a bruised finger. Good for you. It's left back here. There's a lot of space. Marcus down. How? How has he sent it that far away from the goal? That is poor from Marcus Stappers there. Do you think he has already scored in this game? Another free kick here for Braintree. They are killing us from set pieces here thus far in this game. That's over the bar. from the corner. Again, really effective set play from Braintree thus far. Half time potentially two or even three one down here depending on how this throwing goes. Throwing goes. I am struggling with basic speech right now. Oh come on lads. not how we wanted to go into half time. We've had the better chances. And 3 1 is not an uncomebackable from. 4 1 is, though, so I'd rather not concede, lads. Okay, he's finally made a save. But set play, as we know, Braintree have been very effective at. Reynolds can take that. Can you get past the defender? Just about, but that's a foul. Thank you very much. Doesn't really help us though. At this point, we've got nothing to lose if we just absolutely go attacking. Like we're 3 1 down. Zero points and zero points, so we might as well go for it and try and nick a point here. It 
excuse me. Excuse me. That is blasphemous that that's been given as a penalty. What have I just witnessed? 5-2, it finishes. But that is a blasphemous penalty, I'm sorry. He literally won the ball. <laughs> right, Yeovil at home's a tough game as well. Like, I don't I don't need that. No, you don't deserve to be. You're from Bermuda. That's kinda cool. Um I don't know why I'm scouting you. He did he did alright. Um It's pretty cheap though, let's be honest. We're fifth. At the minute. Playoffs. It's what we need for this season. Ideally, we go up this season. It's kind of what we need. Maidstone owner looking for step aside. I would rather not. I don't know what I mean. Yeah. Right, here we go. Into Yeovil. Another home game, hopefully. We can use that to our advantage against a very strong Yeovil side. Keeping the ball nicely. Um, just need to sort of be patient, wait for them to make a mistake. However, at their best, they won't. So it's it's really we'll see. We'll wait and see. Another highlight, and again, it's Yeovil on the ball. That's a brilliant finish from Jordan Young. Not quite getting into a rhythm at the moment. I don't know if they're more positive really helps there, to be honest. Half time, 1 0 down. Get out there and do something, <laughs> please. There we go, we've got a corner. Ah, okay. Good play here from Yeovil when it's two. Oh. Tough couple of games there for us. Brain Tree playing strong. We end up pulling one back late on, but it's a second defeat in two games for us. And once again, look, it's it's our finishing that's letting us down arguably. I 
Ginger update. Yeah. Perry Andolo's injured. Ah, uh, Taunton and Hemel Hempstead. Takeover room is not to be believed. Yeah, this this will be interesting. We do need to sort of snap out of this. And Hemel Hempstead and Taunton are two very winnable games for us. So, Weymouth, Averley, Chippenham. They are winnable games. We just Louisville, I was expecting to lose. Louisville are a strong team. Um... 22nd in the National League last season, came up down with us. At some points, we're even in the championship. So there we go. Step at League 2, FA Trophy. No changes? I'm more inclined to change a few things. We'll make two changes to the lineup. Away from home against Hemel Hempstead. This is again we need to put on a performance because the last two have been disappointing, especially in terms of in front of goal. I don't think I'm a massive fan of the games where we get like half an hour and with no highlights. It's just really pointless. But we have got half an hour and with no highlight. Can we make... Oh, here we go. Free kick. Reynolds. The man to take it. Is he going to go for it? I assume he is. We can take it anytime soon, ladies and gentlemen. All of that for you to just hit the bar. Instant highlight after that though. As Hemel Hempstead look to get an attack of their own, but Fowler covers that off well. Back to Kovacevic. To Greenwich. And Azenolim. This is just going to be a time of me mispronouncing names horribly. Um, crossed in. Amanchi. 1 0. There we go. Beautiful stuff. First goal for Maidstone for Amanchi. Have to be happy with that one. We take the lead away from home against Hemel Hempstead and hopefully something to build on now. Crossed in, cleared away, and Manchi, the man to pick it up, Torn can recross it in, Bone, 2-0. Just before half-time, perfect time to double our lead there. And Sam Torn, again with an assist, he's got a few of those now. It's a game we needed, just a game we need to build on now. We did well first two games, and then it sort of went away a little bit after that. This is Hamill Hempstead's keeper, King. Goal kick. What's going to happen here? Very soon after half-time. That's going to make it all the way to the striker. And then the match just backs off from him, leaving him in a 1v1. But thankfully, he puts wide of the target. But there's no pressure put on him whatsoever. No, we can take him off for our answer, but that is fine by me. 20 minutes to go here. This would see us climb back up to 7th or 8th, depending on other results elsewhere. Obviously, it's the early days in the season, so the positions will change quite a bit. Once we get about halfway through. 
it will sort of stabilise a little bit more. So we get another highlight here, right in their final third. Well, our final third, but their, their, their box crossed into Reynolds and there, and Reynolds scores Lamar Reynolds with a second goal this season, and that's a three 0 and that is definitely our game over. We can just get to full time now, or not. There's another highlight. Is this going to be Hamill Hempstead Gap grabbing a consolation? It is indeed. No, it's not. Offside. I did, I was, I did wonder a bit with that full ball if it was offside, but there we go. Five minutes have gone, six minutes have now gone, and that is full time. Scoring streak. Team stood in five competitive matches. Well, that's good. We are six points off top. Torquay have won every game thus far. They're going to be tough to beat. Um, and Yogel and Maidstone. All three of us are in the National League South. I don't know how that has quite worked out. But there we go. Competition review? No. Right, Taunton. Are they bottom? Because... I know how this works when we play someone bottom of the league. Also, I just want to check something here. Okay, so we cannot play as a striker. That is just checking. He has got seven finishing, though. He's Malaysian. I wouldn't have guessed that, you know. But there we go. The more you know. But yes, Taunton are not quite bottom. But we have Taunton, then Weymouth, then Avalee. That is three. And then Chippingham. Which is three very winnable games there. Four, even. So, if we can get four wins from these four games, that would be lovely. As that goes around Sibia start, Hoyt back in the lineup. We've made a few changes. Let me just save the game. Now we've just got to keep it up. Oh, he's nearly us breaking away. Instead, Taunton keep the ball. Can they create something here? Hoyt heads it away confidently. And now we can come on the attack. Corn. Coleman the draft. All the way back to Greenwich in centre back to Corn. Has a few assists to his name already this season. Coleman the draft. Crossed in. Marcus Dackers. Oh. Just over the bar. Taunton am looking to be one of the weaker sides in the division, so it's definitely one we will be wanting to win. That's not a great ball into the box, I'm going to be honest there. Here's Sam Bone now. To Hoyt. Kelly now. Corn's been great in midfield thus far this season. I have no idea what's just happened, but somehow, we're not one them up. <laughs> oh, so close by Connor Kelly there. We are creating chances, we just need to be more clinical. That's intercepted by Aran Sibia. Garon. Kelly. To Corn. To Garon. Back to Corn. That's got to be offside. Garon to Aran Sibia is offside. Wow. I was like, you're about four years offside. I'm not surprised. Here we go. Torn from the other corner. That's just punched away. Thankfully, we somehow keep the ball. What can Aran Sibia do on the counter? To corn. All the way back to our left back man. 
I get the patient plan, I do understand. I just felt like more could have been done there. Across to Kelly, who has a go, and that's her corner. How many chances are we going to waste? Not that one. Connor Kelly does score now. And five minutes before half time we take the lead. Finally. <laughs> Start watching the Chelsea game on Monday. So many chances. And no goals. But finally we get a breakthrough. And now Taunton have to open up. Don't concede an equaliser straight away. That's good. Don't concede an equaliser straight away. Corner for Taunton. Greenwich clears, but it will still be Taunton applying the pressure. That's also crossed in, but headed very well to the bar from Morgan. Half time, 1 0. Let's keep it up. Free kick, a very dangerous area here. Around Sibia, is he going to have a go? Yes, he does. Uh, Around Sibia now. Corn. Garun. Kelly. Back to Bone. Playing it safe. Waiting for the space to open up. Good ball there. Can we cross it in? Yes, we can. Marcus Dapper's over the bar, man. Ooh. <clears throat> Good ball again out wide to the draft. This time cuts inside, plays it to Aran Sibia, who scores that one. And we do double our lead. Devonta Aran Sibia does get his goal after having one disallowed in the first half. 25 minutes to go, doubled our lead. Crucially, doubling our lead. Yes, we can make some stops. Amanchi. <clears throat> Brown. Reynolds, just for 15 minutes. Full time, 2 0 win. On to the next one. Puts us fifth in the league, still six points behind Torquay. He's saying Bath's only defeat was to us. Indeed, it has been thus far. And now we face Weymouth, away from home. This will be an easy, uh, this will be an interesting one, not an easy one. It's never easy in football, really. Into September now. I don't know when the draws are for second qualifying round for FA Cup. I imagine they've got to be soon. I have to have a look basically based on our fixtures, actually. Uh, Maidstone's IRL fixtures. So obviously, November is first round. Fourth qualifying round was middle of October. Third qualifying round end of September. So 
second qualifying round middle of September, so it should be coming up pretty soon then. Because this is following um, RL fixtures. So at the minute, so they beat Slough, which we did, lost to Bath, we beat Bath, beat Braintree, we lost, drew to Lovell, we lost, drew to Hemel Hempstead, they, uh, we won, drew to Taunton, we won. So four points ahead there, level three points ahead. So we're three points ahead of where most done well at this stage, IRL. They had nine. Not bad. Oh, well, they beat Weymouth 3-2 away from home, so who knows? But they also then lost to my other way. Barcelona in loan through for Man City's Cancelo. That does not surprise me. Reynolds back in the starting lineup. Rested, ready to go here. Way from home, didn't mind. Ah, oh, way more. Again, another stuffed finger for Cover Savage. We still haven't used Hammond yet, but we'll probably use him in the FA Cup. Good play here by us. Reynolds having a... Mm, right. Right, who threw that ball back? Because there's no fans there. So... That was also an awful choice there by Gavin Hoyt to play that ball. Thankfully, it hasn't cost us. Playing it safe. Can you get a bit more adventurous with it now? Yes, he can. Coleman de Graft. Over the top, Dappers. Oh, no. Getting it on Dappers' head, but just he's just not finishing them. Having Hoyt now on the yellow for 70 minutes. That's going to be a fun one. Time nil nil. Would love to be in front right about now, please. We haven't had a shot on target, which is our main concern right about now. Bone also on a yellow. They're really getting at our defence here. That goes all the way back to the keeper. I'm not sure I'm a fan of that. That was the referee. I did think that was the keeper. At first, Marcus Dackers gets his head on it. Once again, over the bar. Still no shot on target. Quite disappointing, if you ask me. having to substitute our keeper as well. That's not good, but... Come on, lads, 15 minutes to go. Oh, a man she nearly, but again, shots not hitting the target. Nine shots, two on target, compared to their five, but four on target. They have been more clinical. If we lift the opponent, yeah, if we just make the opponent's goal 10 feet higher, We'll be like 4 0 up at the minute. Come on, Amanchi from the header. Finally. 
80 minutes in, and Manchi, inspired substitution there, come off the bench to potentially win us the game. 10 minutes to go. We can go back to we can go back to balance now. We don't need to be attacking. But there we go. That's crossed in to Reynolds. No. 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 And ball. Yep, Amanchi showing Dakers how it's done. We might have to start Amanchi next game, to be honest. Oh, Durham's missed the top. Oh, I thought that was going top corner. Hammond gets his debut. Here, we'll bring on Fowler for the last five as well. That's our shoulder. Yeah, well, you can claim that. Kelly, Torn, Amanchi. That was close. I don't mind that. I don't mind that. Seven minutes of injury time. Are you having a giggle, referee? That is a major giggle you're having. That's so much of a giggle. It's like that one Doctor Who episode that's been released soon. Literally called it the giggle. Thankfully, good shift can't hit the target there. Oh, here we go, free kick, just and just finish it off. That's like a whole no half, exactly, it's a whole bunch more time playing football than I want it to be. Really, this game should have ended by now. I don't know why we've got seven whole minutes. Don't give away a penalty. Yes, disallowed. Stuck on that one. Yes, yeah, stuck on that one, Weymouth. <laughs> I was stunned that that's just gone in. Ah. Oh. There we go. Still six points behind Torquay. Still Torquay have not lost a game. And still Bath are... We are the only team to beat Bath this season. He does keep a clean sheet on debut. Tommy Fagg. Right, Avley, Chippenham. I reckon we'll do Avley, Chippenham. And then what we'll do is we'll end up with the FA Cup 7 round qualifying. And do that as well. Probably end it there. If we do end up getting the second round. I'm assuming we're getting the second round qualifying soon. Yeah, unknown at the minute, but we'll get it soon. Hemel Hempstead beat Chelmsford in a game that means literally nothing to me at this stage. Um, we haven't drawn a game yet in this save. Right, Amanchi, you are starting. I said Amanchi, you are starting. Thank you. Into the game against Avalon. Starting well here. Eighty-five percent possession that was after like eight minutes. Eighty percent possession. Come on, lads. You're doing my well, lads. Apart from when you really let them get half of these. I would love it if you could get a shot on target, please. Thank you. Now all we need is a goal. Right, how's it gone from seventy percent to sixty percent possession in like a minute? We have yet to have a highlight in the first half. We have, oh, here we go, corner right at the end of the first half. Oh, he's hit the bar. He's literally hit the bar. And that's half time. Come on, Max. We need some creative spark here. Why is our left back our best performing player? That's not what I need. There's now an Avalie have a corner. Bone can clear that to an Aransibia. He's gonna go on a run here. 
He's got no one really supporting him. Has to play it back to Enzalin, the left back with the 7.0 performance. For Wanhao Smith, played in a Manchi. Oh. Come on, man, it doesn't get much easier than that. Half an hour to go. We don't mind taking um, one house ref off. He is recently coming back from injury. 25 minutes to go here. Let's see if we can press home our advantage. 20 minutes. Just chill out a minute, Greenwich, okay? Keepers, Hammond, claims well. Hoofs it. Interesting choice, gonna be honest. Brown can pick that up. Hoofs that one. Giving it straight to the goalie, man. He's gonna hoof it now. And that is awful. Man, come on lads, all you had to do was finish that chance earlier and that would not be a 1-0 defeat. We would be 1-1 one, one right now, but we have got to massively go on the attack now to try and get something from this game. Again, look at our conversion, 10 shots, only the two on target. Don't care, you're staying on the pitch now after conceding that. This will end 1-0, and another defeat for us that we really should not be getting. We drop down to 7. Bath City finally lose another game, but we're now 9 points behind Torquay. Quite a disappointing performance there. Against Adelaide. When do we get our draw? That's all I care about at the minute. Chipping them away from home. Must win game. We can't be mucking about like that. Remove. Remove. Definitely remove. Probably remove. There we go. I'm not playing around Sibia in midfield, please. Tell me I can play someone else. No, I can't because Sam Bone's on international duty. Oh, that's annoying. Now I see why we're having to play him in midfield. But we'll start Perry and Olo. Marcus Backers returns to the starting lineup after a Manchi mess in a clear cut opportunity costs us well a point it turned out to be. Now away from home against Chippingham is one that we need. Early highlight. Poor, poor, poor from Kelly there. Wasteful with the ball. In control. That's a challenge and a half. Ian Dolo now. Throw around Sibia. 
Back to Riandolo. Dakers, please. Oh, Reynolds. Love that. Eight minutes in, we take the lead. Absolutely love it. That is a performance we need. Get in there early. Again, only 36% of the ball. But we just need to keep picking up the wins. Corner, cleared, not well enough potentially, depending on how this ends. Hits the post. Now it's cleared. But the pressure continues from chipping. Well over. Safe. So we match Maidstone actually and losing to Averley. Half time, uh, just make yourselves happy, I guess. Good interception, Fowler. Sevilla was going to have a go then. Foul up, crosses it in. Dakers. Oh, how many headers just in this stream has that man hit over the bar? I would love to know. Please don't have a go. No, please don't shoot from the front. Because it's going to go over the bar. And I already know it is. Oh, okay. Saved. What can we do from the corner? Cross back in. Clear the way again. Corner again. Clear the way again. Beautiful stuff, cool. Okay. I don't know why he's had a shot from that corner, that's quite I was expecting him to pass that cross goal to maybe that is, but no. Why would we do that? That cross is blocked. That clearance is met by the run. Playing at centre back cross to the stone. Due to international duty players. Fowler Reynolds around Sibia. To Iandolo, who has a go, and that is close, but not good enough for us. One house Smith can play up front as well, so we'll do that. And Manchi, no, we'll just make those the two subs in. Late highlight here. Foul up, winning the ball back confidently. Reynolds can go on a bit of a run now. Oh, to strike it on the volley from that far out is respectable. I have to appreciate that. Ten minutes to go. How's it going? Um, I mean, okay, so far. I mean, we've just beaten Chippenham 1-0. Uh, we are 7th in the league. We have 6 wins, 3 defeats. Oh, Torquay haven't played yet. I was like, oh my god, we've gained points on Torquay, but they've not played yet. So they'll probably win. Keep 9 points clear of us. Who do they play? Clearly no one I'm good, because I can't see another 8. They play Chelmsford. Okay. 
still waiting to find out who we get in the second round qualifying draw. I don't know when that's going to be, because we're apparently meant to be... Ah, here we go. Hang on, how many teams? 160 teams. Well, I'm not watching all that. Wharton and Hersham. That's the people from the TikTok account, isn't it? Hang on, I swear that's the people from the TikTok account. There's like, I don't know, I mean, most small clubs probably have a TikTok account, but this one where it's like, hang on, they're like three young lads that own them. I need to search up now. Wharton. Oh, it is as well. That's quite funny, actually, that we've managed to pull them. But there we go, they are our opponents, and this will probably be the final game of the stream. Um, but yeah, so six wins, three defeats, got our first cup game. Hopefully we can get a win. We want to get to the big rounds. We want to get, as far as Maidstone have IRL, ideally, second round at the minute, Barrow next in real life for us. But here we go. Going full strength. Must remote your button save. Okay, well, if you do go live in like the next, um, however long this match takes, which could be from anywhere between 5 and 20 minutes, uh, I will head over, you know. Right, here we go, from the free kick. Fowler, nearly. It's so close. We just need to show our quality against sides like this, and the goals will flow. Good ball. Kelly, Corn, ah, Greenwich. Not like the, the time, Greenwich meantime, right, that's crossed in. Marcus Dappers, please, thank you. Finally, this man has scored a header. And we lead in the FA Cup. I'm not going to get too excited about it. It's a team we should be beating. We have done full strength. I'm just to ensure we do. And to keep the players fit and sharp. And that's a mistake. Not punished though. <clears throat> Greenwich once again, Corn. Our midfield, I thought, has been quite strong. Corn and Kelly. Yep, that works. Oh, you so could have played that back to one house, Smith backers. <laughs> Lamar Reynolds from the header, 2 0. Two crosses, two goals in 18 minutes. We've got two goal lead. I think the key thing here for this slam especially is to not be complacent. We are at the corner that's crossed in nearly from that goes. Has that been Smash home with conviction. We have another corner. Can it go the same way? Not quite. Another corner though for us. <laughs> what can we do from this one? One of these has got to end in a goal, surely. Both our goals have come from crosses thus far, and the corner is just a big cross. No. Running. Oh, nearly over the top to call, and that was an ambitious ball.
No time to now. Just keep doing what you're doing, lads. I'll we'll make it to the next round. Crossed in, Dappers, no. Reynolds. Oh, of course he's just going to bang that one in. Fifth goal of the season for Lamar Reynolds already. And that is quite something. If you're tired, we've only got 25 minutes. We have a free goal lead. I'm not too worried. Oh, claimed well there. They haven't had a shot. I haven't noticed that, I'm going to be honest. You almost jinxed me there with that missed header. But look, it is a team that is like three divisions, not three divisions, like a good couple of divisions below us. So the quality is quite large in terms of difference. Fowler crosses it in, Dappers 4 no, He's now in five for the season as well. And 15 minutes to go, we are cruising to a victory here in front of our home fans. They actually haven't. That is actually so sad, I kind of feel bad for them. But at the same time, let's go score more goals. Kelly, go on. Oh, go on. Oh. Nearly. Nearly, nearly, nearly. Free kick. Mr. Who are you? Reynolds. George Fowler somehow ends up with a goal. Get offside. Will not count. Jesus. Five minutes of injury time. Here we go. A chance for a fifth. You bet it is. Man, how old. Flipping it. What is it with headers just going massively over the bar? Full time, 4 0 win. Wonderful stuff. Routine, basically. Tamworth. Oh, we face Worthing next. Sixth place in the league. Actually, have a draw to their name. Unlike us, we get a nice three k. You got two assists. Go on. I think he's had quite a few this season. I tell a lie. No, he's had four. Four assists. Uh, that's pretty decent. And he has got the most assists in the league. Lamar and Marcus Stafford. Both with five, the highest goal scorers. Good 400k in the budget. Is it a bit too early to make a request? Because... It's probably too early for that, but there we go. FA Cup, 90 teams, I'm just going to skip Avali. No, not Avali. They are a bogey team at the minute. Ah, oh, we want revenge on Avali. That is, that is for certain. Oh, let's go. We're getting improved new facilities. This is lovely, I just say. Already making upgrades. Chelmsford beat Torquay. Are you having a lot of Truro are now doing on beat inside the league with six wins, three draws? Wow. Shock. Can 
my turn is out. The reserves lose, that's fine. So I'm not too fussed about the reserve team. Oh, that's not good. Um, I did say we end up here, so I believe we shall. Uh, ben, do you know when you're going live yet? <clears throat> or if you're going live? Oh, they're in Division 7, so they're what? Just a one tier below us. Oh, okay. So, Walton and Hersham. Walton and Hersham, that is. Just realised that I'm not tipped up by her. But there we go. In like 10 minutes. Okay. In that case, we'll do this game against, um, whoever this team is, Worthing. Hopefully get a win. And there we go. Well, let's get into it then. Very early highlight here. No, not Luke White. Reynolds. Oh, what a save. That was a brilliant save, I just say. That was a free kick in a very dangerous area, and I'm not sure I like it. Ooh. Le Mole. Good spell of possession here. Wanghouse missed them. Played him beautifully. Marcus, oh Marcus, that is man, you frustrate me so much. You've got five goals, but you should have about twelve. How you've missed that is baffling to me. Get in there. We scrimmage. We lead twelve minutes in. First goal from the corner. Very happy with that one. It's what we deserve as well. That play goes all the way back to their keeper. Is he back after injury? I don't know what games he's missed, to be honest. He might have been back quite a while. Wanhouse Smith nips the ball beautifully and then plays it all the way back to our keeper. Not sure why. But there we go. Marcus Dappers. Marcus Dappers. Marcus Dappers. Get in there. Killing it. 20 minutes in. Sixth goal for Marcus Dappers. Now solely a top score thus far. Oh. Only gets an assist as well, I've just realised. I love that. Golf McCullough. Oh my god, Reese Greenwich has scored a brace. It's 3 0. What's going on? <laughs> We're having a struggle to keep up with us at the minute. And two near identical goals from Greenwich, and then Marcus Dafford's from a long ball. I cannot complain about that one. At all. They need a goal before half time. You cannot deny them that, why they? That's not a great clearance by the left back there, in the line. Wait to win the header. Well, oh, fine, that works, I guess. Ten minutes ago before half time. Again, like lads, let's just focus a minute. As a go, that's a beautiful shot by Ollie Pierce there. 3 1. 
back into it a while and they needed a goal before half time and this is why I told them to focus because that sort of thing is not what I need. Wait. Crossed in. Not a great cross. Boom, go on. All about it. Back to Greenwich. One out Smith. Durham, 4-1. Bimesh Durham will be second of the season. I believe his first since opening day. So, been a little while coming, but there we go. Our free goal lead has been restored. Oh, come on, bugger off. Well, that wasn't giving us a penalty, to be honest. Luke played against his former club. Not today, my friend. Half time, 4-1. Let's just keep things going. We don't need to go up above what I think after this game. So the rest of the game is going the conventional way that you would expect them to. Here we go. Wait, from the front, crosses it in. One house nip isn't there. You ridiculous, ridiculous man. Why have you re I mean, fair enough, you almost scored it. Which is ridiculous in itself, to be honest. One tickets. I was going to have a look at these. I will do it out of the screen. Final five minutes. It's been a pretty tame second half, but we got the job done in the first half. Full time, 4 1 win. Beautiful, beautiful stuff. Up to six. Only six points off of Torquay now, actually, which is quite a crucial thing. And then we're immediately going into the third round, qualifying round of the FA Cup. Point time, uh, praising. Yeah, there we go. People like me now. Which Greenwich is injured? That's not really what I want to be hearing. I'm gonna be honest. Tottenham to discuss a new contract for Kane. Oh yeah, this in this world, Kane's still a Tottenham. Got that. Um, 